This tart is also known as a Gillette and it is so easy to make. All you have to do is roll out a big round piece of pastry, dump your filling in, fold up the edges and throw it in the oven. And that's it. So it's really fast, it's really tasty. We're gonna be using some fresh plums and a bit of honey and that's about it. So let's get started. So I've got about two pounds of fresh Italian plums or prune plums. I'm going to be uh, halving them and then quartering them, tossing them with a, like a rounded tablespoon of brown rice flour and then a bit of honey, maybe two tablespoons, and then that'll be ready for our filling. Now that our filling is done, it's time to roll out the pastry. You want to start by wiping down your counter with a nice wet cloth and then covering the counter with saran wrap. We're gonna be rolling out quite a large piece, so we'll need two pieces of saran wrap on your counter. A gluten-free pastry is sticky and it's much easier to roll out on saran wrap. I will show you exactly how to do it. It's not very hard at all. What you're gonna to wanna to do is you need to get a uh, pizza pan and we're gonna be rolling out the pastry to be just a bit larger, just a bit larger than your, your pan. So that when we put our pastry on here, put the filling in, then the edges will just fold up. So that's how big, but I'll show you, it's easy, don't worry about it. I've successfully rolled out my pastry. Now if you need a bit of a tutorial on how to make the pastry and the recipe, etc., just click the link below and we've got a great video teaching you exactly how to make this pastry. We used the entire recipe for this particular tart. Now we take our filling and pour it into the center and then fold up all the edges around the fruit. Now the nice thing with this recipe is that you don't need to just use plums, you can use any fresh fruit you want. It's very versatile. I'm gonna take some nice egg and do a nice uh, do an egg wash here, and then we'll be sprinkling the egg with some nice thick granulated sugar. Granulated sugar. Now we take our pie pan and slip it underneath our part here like that. And you want to fold these down a little bit. And then we throw this into a 400 degree Fahrenheit oven and uh, cook it until it's nice and golden and bubbly. The tart is done. I baked it for 50 minutes in a 400 degree Fahrenheit oven. And it's so beautiful, look at it. And what a simple dessert to make. It's just rolling out the pastry, putting the filling in, folding up the edges, and it just looks amazing.